What is up YouTube, it is Matty, and we are in the War vs Kara Heroes, a well-known Fair Play War Clan, and yeah, we've got our work cut out, and we're, you know, the war's um, halfway through now, and I'm going to try and do a, three, a live three-star attack on the base number 30 from my mini account, which is also number 30 on our side, which has already been three-starred. So, I'm just going to have a quick look at the base, take a screenshot, go into Skitch, draw out a plan, and then we can... Um, take it from the hold on um, the sketch here we are let me uh, just exit any previous plans bring up the new one and let's quickly draw it out so I've uh, I'm getting better and better at sketch nowadays so hopefully you're gonna find this insightful um, I'm gonna do a shattered go oh, um, let me draw a bit of a bigger arrow for that I'm gonna do a shattered go uh, with the golems coming in from such angles as that um, because if you look on this base, the obvious sort of giant bomb threats are there and there. And obviously the queen and the king are all the way over here. So what I'm actually going to try and do, um, which was a plan that was sort of um, talked about by Temetric, who one of the members who was going to take it himself. But then we realised my heroes were lower, so it would be a good idea for me to try it first. Um, but essentially, if I can use a jump spell in, let me show you the compartment, get it nice and yellow, if I use a jump spell sort of here, um, it'll allow me into the compartment with the double, um, with the, the double giant bomb threat, and the compartment next to the queen where she's going to jump over to and the king can go and take her down anyway, so that'll be good, um, oh, my troops will go in, the cannon and the, uh, arch tower next to it. it should go down by wizards on the uh, the initial drop you'd hope if not the queen will take them down so you can have a nice x hold on let me make this a little bit thicker uh, so it stands out nicely nice x there nice x there um definitely the arch tower the air defense um but it's a little bit questionable whether they're going to hit the sweeper or the the air defense and if they do they're going the wrong way so i've got to assume that they sort of don't so what i'm actually going to do and and it took me a little while to f to decide this is i'm going to send like a, a group of say five hogs well that, that is a bit thick for this uh, if i drop that down i'm going to send a group of like five hogs in here now you've got to assume there's a tesla there which if that's the case fine um but if, the, if not, then if I send the hogs in from the angle, that they go to the air defence next. I'm going to do this while my kill squad are going in, my golems and that, so the arch tower, the cannon are all distracted anyway. Um, and it's going to sort of help take that air defence down, because if it doesn't, um, on the main attack, when I send... Because <laughs> what the other part of what I'm going to do is, I'm going to send a giant in. So let me draw the picture. Hold on, I'll get it orange for the giant. I'm going to send a giant in there, and I'm going to send a giant in over here, um, and then I'm just going to sort of spray like three hogs in on, let me figure it out, one, two, three, one, two, three, and one, two, three. I might need to drop a heal at this point, but I'm not 100% sure yet, um, because I also need that um, mortar to go down. But I'll wait to see how that goes. Um, a couple of testers might pop up by that mortar. But the idea being that if they can take that uh, um, arch tower down, when I do my hog drop and I sort of follow this line, if I come in sort of down here through the arch tower, they're going to circle back through and finish up going down there. So if they sort of follow that line, at that point I can drop a heal spell have a look um, if I drop my heal spell sort of over here keep them alive now the, the risk is if there is any other building sort of left I've got to be very mindful of that mortar um, because if the hogs sort of travel back over to it they might hit some of the double giant bomb threats so what I've got to do before while I drop my big main group um, over sort of through the top through 12 o'clock but after which is after i've sent my initial group to go and sort of take down the giant bomb threat and take down a few defenses in the process um i need yeah i need to also send in say three 
three hogs or four hogs depending on the uh, on the, the other side of the base as well to take down that mortar because if that oh sugar if that doesn't go down and my thing's gone black let's get that green again okay so now if I go back to black I've just got to be careful that I, I make sure to take that down as well um, so yeah it's a bit unknown without the Tesla locations but uh, and also I've got some defenses <laughs> wow I've got some defenses over here as well so hopefully they're gonna sort of go down with either King and the Queen um, as part of the process so yeah I know it's a bit of a messy drawing but that's the plan let's see if we can deliver it um, yeah gonna be interesting I've got my army cooked up so I've got eight wizards five for the um, initial tank and then three cleanup three giants I'm probably gonna drop a giant down um, at the north side of the base before I drop the hogs in just to give them that bit of extra weight I have got two heal spells so I'm just gonna I'm gonna have to see where my hogs are gonna go to, to warrant where I'm gonna put my heal spells um, but I've got a rage spell to help the kill squad as well so I think we're ready to uh, to get this job done let's go and have a look drop my golems down at the start wizard just to the right of that um, camp so that the uh, arch tower doesn't get it another wizard on the mine another wizard on the army camp um, so I'm going to drop five wizards down here just to really help try and take some of the defences down as well drop the queen down we'll drop the king down eventually jump spell in to get those troops going in as well and then throw the five hogs in so hopefully that all works out quite nicely um, let's have a look and see how we go hopefully I can get the job done um, and then we'll take we'll take it as it goes Okay, in we go. Golem 1, Golem 2, Wizard 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Get the Queen down as well while all that's happening. I'm going to drop 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Hogs over here. Look, I've dropped into the right side of the arch tower. I'm going to drop my jump spell down there. And you can see Hogs have done the trip. Hopefully they're going to... Um... Oh, there's not a giant bomb there. I'm going to drop... Rage spell down as well. King sort of drop in so he can go into the base. The poison is there to help take everything down. The queen's doing work. The king's doing some work. The loons are about to go down, it looks like, which is good. Uh, meanwhile, I'm going to drop giant one and giant two over here. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. King ability. One, two. I need my hogs to keep moving through the base, get through the archer tower. Um, to go and trip the giant bomb threat. Don't know if they're going to be able to do it. Here we go. The can the thing is going down as well. Um, meanwhile, I'm going to start the big hog drop now. One, two, three, four, five. I'm going to save a few hogs for the end. Look, uh, Queen is still alive. We're going to send in some hogs over here. Heal spell one. Um, get that down. Meanwhile, clean up. One wizard over here. One wizard over here. One wizard up there as well. Queen ability. Just going to look back over for the hogs now. Um, looks like I'm going to save my heal spell for the final part of the raid and I'm going to set, use a uh, goblins over this side as well and I think that's it I've used all my troops looks like I'm pretty good for the three star on it looks really comfortable actually um, yeah giant bomb threats, threats were where we guessed which is sick uh, <laughs> I mean they were sort of obvious because the um, the defense gap and the fact that there were like HP buildings um, either side, so that they had to sort of path over them. The pathing just made sense for them to be there, um, which means I've been able to almost finish this raid with a, pretty much a minute, just a, just under a minute on the clock, which is awesome. So, uh, whew, really glad to be able to bring a three star to the to the to the clan. That's amazing, excellent. And um, let's have a quick little review. I didn't tell anyone what's going in. I just sort of did because I, I was in a bit of a rush. Um, thank you, Van. Th oh, Stewie. Boom. Pan, Stewie, uh, Alpha, um, Savoni, all people watching me. So I'm glad you enjoyed that raid. Uh, I think that's Malcolm in the background congratulating me as well. So let's see how it went. Analyze it a little bit. This obviously is an 8.5 that isn't exposed. So there's certain things that make it a bit easier. It's similar to my base um, in terms of... Uh, upgraded levels of, uh, of buildings I suppose except his air defense is a max and it looks like his Tesla's a max as well um, <laughs> thank you Mel 
that group of hogs did really well. They, uh, they, they. I, I was worried there might be a spring trap there to sort of stop them. And in fact, a couple looked like they went and took down that mortar, which I was a little bit worried about, if you remember as well. And the hogs went in and helped take down the um, another an extra defence at the start. Uh, wizard, I, I was hoping the defences near the queen were going to go down as well. Um, looks like the king king fight and queen fight went quite, quite well. The golem was in there distracting. So that all went perfectly actually. And you can see next to the sweeper, the um, the sweeper survived. But the this second group of hogs, remember the Tesla popped them, which scared me. So I, I, I dro I'd messed up my hog drop a bit. But I didn't want to just keep dropping hogs now. So I just thought I'll leave it happen. And now it's sort of eliminated the double giant bomb threat. But actually the hogs have gone back in and tripped it anyway, which is perfect. They all died, um, which was fine. And then my big main hog, uh, hog drop came in. I had two heal spells now to take down the base. I sent those extra three in to go and sort of distract the... Um, the arch tower, it went down. You can see the wizard tower is distracted as well. And that just worked very beautifully. And um, then the hogs came in the back end. I had that heal spell, which I barely... I don't think I even needed that heal spell either. Um, but it, it was helpful. So a big shout out to Temetric, who sort of gave me the idea to you know send in suicide hogs at the start. Then the main group at the end um, to, to go and to trip that one giant bomb threat. And the kill squad to go and take down the uh, other sweeper. But I did ad lib a bit and add those extra hogs into the air defense to go and do the trip. So I'm going to call the video a day there. Thank you. Uh, a big shout out to everyone that uh, enjoys this series. And I hope to see you guys in the next one. So peace out. <laughs> and Malcolm says bye too.